until we discuss those states. We um, have the interview of a lifetime. We have Brisket County Jr. Give me a second. <clears throat> um, Brisket. Brisket. Hold on. Brisket, brisket, can you can you hear me? Yeah. Awesome. So we've got Brisket County Jr. here, you guys, and he's current. It looks like you're currently in the airport yourself. That's right. Mommy lets me go on the airplane all by myself. So Brisket, what's a top dog lawyer like you going to Pennsylvania for? I'm not a dog. I'm a baby. That, okay, yes, that's true. That's technically true. Um, what is a baby like you going to Pennsylvania for? Well, I'm going to go up there and make sure that they count all the votes fair and square, along with a bunch of other baby lawyers. Ooh, so it's a bunch. Are you are you a part of like a baby? We're all big lawyers and we're all big babies. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Yeah. So, you are part of a coalition of baby lawyers? I don't know about coalitions, but I sure like to go fishing with my dad. So. But sometimes he drinks too many drinks, and then he gets, then he gets mad. He threw me off the boat one time, but then after a while, they let me see it again. The boat? They threw you off the boat? Yeah, my oh. daddy did after he, had, after he had too many cans to drink. <laughs> you know, Brisket, I'm a little speechless from that. You have me speechless. Let's go back to, um... But I can talk even though I'm a baby. But you can't even though you're a grown-up. That's funny. <laughs> I know, right? So, Brisket, um, what do you think your law firm will be able to provide to the Trump campaign that they don't already have with non-baby lawyers, I guess? I mean, being a baby lawyer, that's different. That's new. That's right. We're, we're the first generation of baby lawyers. And what we're going to offer the Trump campaign campaign is lots of legal advice, like how he can throw his baba at the vote counters when they're not being fair and when they're counting too many votes for Biden. Well, you say that. Do you do you feel um, genuinely that Biden is rigging this election? Yeah, he's bad. And as as a baby, he, um, when did he you realize? He needs, a, he, needs, he needs a spanking. And my mommy like, and daddy give me spankings, especially when they have lot that when they've had lots of drinks from um, their cans and babas. So that's what I want to do to the Biden campaign because they're cheating and it's not <laughs> Um, so, but you seem very, like, do y'all, do you, does your, does your firm have any ev evidence of the, the cheating happening? You seem very sure. Oh, yeah, we have lots of evidence that, that the Biden campaign is cheating because they're getting more votes than Mr. Trump, and that's not fair! <laughs> and we'll see them in court. All right. Well, Brisket, it, I, I hear them calling for your flight number, so um, you better... Oh, I'm, oh, thank you. I don't know my number. I know, yet. I know, I know. I figured, so... I'm going to let you go catch your flight, but thank you for popping in and talking with us today, and I hope you make it to Pennsylvania on your own and don't get, like, abducted or something.
I like when the airplane goes. Well, yes. But then it gets too high, and then my ears hurt, and then I cry the whole way there. Well, I feel bad for anyone on your flight. Thank you, guys. I feel bad for America. <laughs> I, too, feel bad for America.